This is a video showing how to model and 3D print an alligator clip using Sindo's 3D Walk Sketch. We will start with a new part using millimeters as dimensions and then sketch on the top plane. We will be doing the simpler version of the alligator pin, starting with lines and mirror tools to create the basic body. Essentially, it will look like a trapezoid. We'll add the head using lines and arcs. feature allows us to connect the two sketches together. To adjust the shape, we can move sketch points and add tangent relations. The next part will be the scales, or rather bumps, on the alligator's back. Again, just using sketch lines to draw multiple triangles and then trim to connect the corresponding sketches to the main body. Make sure the endpoints of the sketch are connected to the main body. We need to extend the body to make more room for the mouth. Now, using the same type of sketch pattern, we can draw the mouth. It doesn't have to be perfect, but make sure that there is a large enough gap between the teeth. The next step is adding fillets of size 1 millimeter. For the teeth, we want 0.5 millimeter fillets.
our necks, we want to make sure that they're relatively equal in size and flat so that it can balance. We can use the copy entities tool to accomplish this. Make sure that the sketch points are connected to the main body after copying, and don't forget to trim. The sketch is now completed so we can add the feature, extruded boss base of size 10 millimeters. We will then add a circle sketch on the top base. We will extrude cut through all to make the eyes. We have finished the model, so now we can save it and then open the Sendo 3D box toolbar. There is an option called Print 3D. This extension can be downloaded from Sendo's website. This opens up the interface that allows us to determine the size and position of the 3D print. The best way to print this model is to lay it flat on the side. Finally, press Preview and then save the G-code file onto the USB. A more complicated version allows for pinching the body to open the mouth wider. It involves more detailed sketches and extruded cuts.